Hey everyone, welcome back to another video and this video I'm gonna talk about how to fix Battlefield 6 freezes and crashes and does not respond within few minutes after the launch on a PC or it completely cut off the music and it is unresponsive then how we can fix this. So this issue is happening for both Steam users as well as the users on the uh, you know EA Sports. So in my case I'm having the game on Steam. We can do the or you can follow the same steps over here for the EA Sports as well. You can use the same step. So the thing is, first the only one solution that's going to help you guys of this all about, you have to go over here, search for Windows Security, click on the Windows Security. Now from here, click on App and Browse Control. Now from here, click on Expert Protection Settings. Now from here, click on Program Settings, and he, and from here you have to click on plus icon that is add program to customize just click on this plus icon now click on choose exact file path now you just need to go to the game installation directory so in my case the game is installed on local disk e so get into this folder go to steam library steam apps common glacier events now from here i have to select this and i have to open now we'll be getting this particular thing now we have to make few changes here so the first one you have to put a check on this particular box then make sure this is turned off scroll down put a check on this particular box make sure this is turned off put a check on this box make sure turn it off put a check on this box make sure this is turned off put a check on code integrity guard make sure it is turned off put a check on control flow guard you have to turn this off whatever is turned on after putting a check you have I mean turn it on you have to put it you have to disable it I mean turn it off then put a check on the box put a check on data execution prevention you have to turn this off go to disable extension points turn this off turn this off put a check on this box turn this off put a check on this box turn this off now we have to turn this off if anything now as you can see it is turn it on you have to put a check then turn this on sorry turn this off now turn this off turn this off turn this off Go over here, you have to turn this off. Go over here and go to here. Make sure you have to put a shift check on all the boxes and make sure all these are turned off. Now go for apply. Now after the apply, you have to do a restart. Then after the restart, I mean after the restart is done, if you're on the game with the EA Sports, launch the game from there. Or if you're on the Steam, you can launch the game from here. You'll not be having any kind of trouble like this. So this is a quick video. I hope this quick video is helpful. And if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification. See you soon in the next video. Peace out. Bye bye.